Painting is like thinking, but in, a, in an abstract, in a total abstraction. So I think without words, without, without talking. When I first studied, I was young, very young, 14, 15, 16, something like that. I studied the old masters' works. And I used to read about each artist, uh, like Rembrandt is one of them, and learn from it and copied the painting in the same technique that he did it. And uh, I haven't done anything with old masters since then <laughs> until uh, this exhibition. And this is a totally new experience to me, to get inspired by this kind of work and to, to do my own version of it. I waited for each painting to call me. And uh, we walked through the gallery a couple of times and I immediately chosen four, five or six paintings to get inspired by. And I went back to the studio and I worked without any, without any preparation. The only painting that I prepared a little bit for it was the big one, the nymphs by a fountain. I imagined it as a very big and huge one because of the bodies uh, that they are laying on a fountain next to each other, on top of each other in a way. There is one body in the front, uh, it looks like a man, and, and they're supposed to be a nymph, so, so they're supposed to be all of them a woman, but I think he's a man because all his muscles are very muscular. I wanted to use the same gestures and the same body that he used it. So I repeated it, but I distorted everything. So I decided that I want to mirror it. Then when I work, everything was a uh, kind of improvisation. I just spread many colors or more, all the colors that I have on, on my palette and just start to work without any decision what color I want to use. It's kind of meditation, instinctive meditation. So it's, it comes like that. That's how I feel when I paint. The girl by the window, it's very nice. It really suggests many things. Not only a girl relaxing by a window. It could be a maid, it could be a girl that escapes this moment or maybe boring life to, to imagine something. So it has depth in it. Music, poetry, uh, painting, any kind of art. It should do this to me. It needs to move me. Uh, it should have this kind of depth. I would like my work to penetrate the subconscious mind of the viewer and to move something inside him and to leave him with many questions and hopefully some answers. So I want my work to shake everyone who sees it.